ढाई सौ ग्राम देना दो पीस दो चिकन का पहले हाँ अरे वाह क्या बिरयानी है किसका हाथ है इस बिरयानी में बहुत बहुत उम्दा सो वन इज द स्मोक डजेंट गेट इन टू द शॉप एंड द सेकेंड थिंग इज वेन यू आर पासिंग बाई यू सी अ जूसी मॉर्सल ऑफ मीट ग्रिलिंग ऑन दैट स्क्यू अ विद ऑल दैट मोल्टन फैट यू डेफिनेटली से ओके फाइन लेट मी गिव इट अ बेट ऑफ अ टेस्ट कहते हैं ओल्ड डेली का फ्राइड चिकन है के एफ सी ऑफ ओल्ड डेली चिकन इज वेरा नाइस क्रंची आउटसाइड सॉफ्ट एंड जूसी इन साइड डिलीशियस मैन बहुत बढ़िया आपसे मोहब्बत हो गया ये पीकर समटाइम्स यू टेस्ट अ न्यू डिश यू डोट नो वॉट टू एक्सपेक्ट and it awakens your spirit jostles your taste buds that's the sort of nahari that's the sort of plate that this is mm. to dore kebab tha wo nahi hai ab kidhar so dora kebab apparently this Haan. chap has passed away ha so it's not available anymore so his oh. son is not able to do it and uh, that's what i was looking around masjid ke niche wo baitha tha chhota sa stall tha uska so well we are back here on matiya mahal street because yesterday when we were here we tried a lot of things but we couldn't try the biryani so today we going to do the biryani as well you want to taste something here rais kebab corner ye mutton ka hai mutton ka hai ha to mutton dena hame एक ही साल पुराना वेल वी स्टॉप डेयर टू इंक्वायर ऑफ द डोरा कबाब विच अनफॉर्चुनेटली इज नॉट अ पार्ट ऑफ द ऑफर हियर वी आर टोल्ड बट देन वी सॉ सम नाइस मटन सीक बींग ग्रिल्ड सो वी सेट विल शुरुआत करें लेटेस्ट ट्राई वन मटन और एक सलिया वो देना डोरा कबाब आई डोंट थिंक वी फाइंड मैन यू टू मेक इट यूज टू मेक इट नेक्स्ट जनरेशन they don't know how to do it so that's what i you know that i think that is a challenge with a lot of these very traditional sort of places right Absolutely. so if the next generation is not waiting in the wings unfortunately some of these dishes die out i guess the whole point is when you can taste it taste it pata nahi aaj hai lekin kal pata nahi ha that is the same i want to go for uh, the kebab which is without too much of the yogurt you know i like to taste the flavor of the meat nahi nahin that's the right thing to do I find this kebab a little salty. Hmm. Hmm. Masala is a little upper. Hmm. And it's a little dry as well. But I think it's overcooked. Juicy, nahi. The reason why people keep returning to certain places is because over a period of time they've been able to consistently satisfy most palates mm -hmm. today while we were walking and we wanted to check on this dora kebab we happened to stop at this particular shop mm -hmm. to check on it and that's when we saw this kebabs grilling and since we got all that information we said okay fine as a courtesy we'll taste the kebab so the kebab is fine but like amit said i think it's a little mm -hmm. masaledar <clears throat> i think it's more for a local palate they yeah. would they would expect it with little more garam masala but um, slightly overcooked it's not juicy it doesn't have enough fat oh अमूल क्रीम अमूल बटर आप चाहे ना चाहे वो डलता ही है सब में वेन द लोकल सीट आउट दे वॉन्ट अट ऑफ दैट घर में नहीं शाही ट्रीटमेंट एंड दैट शाही ट्रीटमेंट इज फाउंड यूर इन ऑल दैट मक्खन एंड क्रीम दैट यू सी फ्लोटिंग ऑन टॉप ऑफ दैट कबाब आई डोट नो वेट टू बिगिन पिकअप एंड ईट आई होप दिस इज सॉफ्ट एंड जूसी I think the chicken is definitely better. Mm. Very juicy. It's got a nice char on the outside and very juicy on the inside. Very nice. I would have liked to taste it also without being smothered in all that cream and the butter, but then. But it is juicy inside. Mm. <coughs> nice. It's not that dry. 
It's got good roasting, nicely charged. Well, it's not for faint-hearted. Yeah. You can't count your calories when you're eating this. I think between the mutton and the chicken, I think our vote certainly goes to that chicken. Roti ke saath, uh, they also give you normal roti. So they have a meal. Mm. This becomes a sauce. So I think this is a sort of generic kebab that you'll expect to find in most of these places. Hmm? Yeah. So I think most places you will have a experience that's satisfactory. And of course then you will find the stars in between. Absolutely. Hmm? The yeah. sauce that will leave an impression. I think that's a sort of eating out that you will find here in Matiya Mahal. Hmm? So here I have seen that in the whole shop, the work of making the bread is out. So, you should see people. This is advertising. In advertising, then, in the shop, there is a smoke in the shop. So, it works both ways. So, one is the smoke doesn't get into the shop. And the second thing is when you are passing by and you see a juicy morsel of meat grilling on that skewer with all that molten fat, you definitely say, okay, fine, let me give it a bit of a taste. And especially when they are dousing it with some, what is that? Butter. Butter. Rice Kebab Corner. Fantastic. Well, Amit is giving a few of his tips to the shop out there. I think that's the advantage that you have when you are doing a food walk with chefs. Amit may have given him one, one nuska or two just so that he can elevate his game. A bit, especially with that mutton. I think that mutton seek had promise. And uh, I'm sure with some direction. What happens is it's just a matter of just a couple of one minute maybe extra uh, on the grill. That's all it takes, one minute less. And maybe some extra fat inside the mixture uh. or on basting on top. Well, we're headed down this quiet lane off the main road, past Shabrati Foods where we had the Nahari. And I'm told this leads to a popular biryani haunt. There is a chicken biryani and a big biryani. So, we will try both. So, first we will try chicken. Give it 2 grams. First of all, chicken. Oh, wow. Let's try it. हर चीज खास है इसमें। ये हमारे भाई कानपुर से यहाँ खाने हैं। कानपुर से खाने आए हैं। तो फिर दिल पसंद बिरयानी। यार आप चम्मच तो है लेकिन हाथ से खाइए आप। हाथ से खाने में मजा कुछ और है हाँ। This is a long range दा। Long range। सेला चावल। हाँ। But it is it is a good quality, very good quality सेला। वो आपने वहाँ पे भी खाया है? I love the flavour of the rice। Rice I think that rice is moist, juicy. juicy. See, to me, a good biryani, Amit, when you put it in your mouth, it should sing to you. I do not accept anything less. When you put it in your mouth, it should sing to you. And that's what this is. Delicious. Moist. Taste it. I have tasted it. It's very good. 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 Excellent. We have not even eaten the chicken piece so far. But just that rice in that biryani is flavorful. I think it's a masala that goes in. Because obviously this is not the meat, it's a chicken. So chicken has very little flavor to contribute. But I think the masala that goes in, maybe with the onions, the spices, spices yogurt, some yogurt, the green chilies. Meat like that is. Ah. See again, this is a sort of meat. That is, it's falling off the bone. Awesome. Yesterday, we did an extended walk here in this area. And by the time we got to the shop, it was rather late. And we just had the Nihari before Nihari. that. And we came here and we said, if we taste it now, we may not appreciate it as much. And therefore, we've come the next day specifically to taste this. And it's, I think, worth it. And I think it's absolutely worth it. Go ahead. Mm. So this is the leg and there's a breast. 
yeah. piece as well. So I mean, you will feel the difference. Huh. So of course, the leg is more juicy. More juicy. Yeah. Still is good. I think you can combine it with the rice and the meat. Mm. Yeah, biryani. Hai. Kista hath hai is biryani mein. Bahut, bahut umda. Of course, in the breast piece, it's a little more chewy as opposed to the. Try, but that would be. That would be. But leg will be juicier. The chawal jo hai iska, especially with that leg piece, with that drumstick. I think okay, nice. it's a ten on ten biryani, Amit. A chicken biryani. I'm coming from you, Nepal, because you've eaten at many many places, mm. you know, including Hyderabad. But this is the speciality of this area. I'm loving also the manner in which that biryani is seasoned. Yeah. Hmm. And you don't need any raita. Nothing. You don't need any salan. Nothing. In fact, if you ask me, you don't even need the meat. The rice itself. Just itself. the rice itself has so much flavour. This is again a paki akni sort of biryani. No, this will be layered. This will be layered, layered but, then but uh, they'll cook the meat first, uh, right? Not, not fully. Okay. Not fully. So. Hmm. I think three, four they will cook and then they would layer it. So in those handies, big handies like that. Delicious. Yeah. I'm sure ये किसी और किचन में बनता होगा यहाँ पे क्योंकि this is a very tight space. पुरानी दुकान है इनकी सबसे पुरानी दुकान. Whatever the case may be, wherever they may be making it, that biryani handi is a proverbial pot of gold. At the end of Matia Mahal Road, because that's really the location of this place. You got to walk all the way from Jama Masjid Gate Number One. Gate Number One. To the end of Matia Mahal, you come to the first chowk, then come to the second chowk, then take a left, go past Shabrati Foods, wind your way, find your way through the narrow alley, and you'll wonder, "Kaha ho aap?" And then you will come across Muhammad Taufik Biryani and his two biryani handis, screaming the presence of what awaits you right at the door. Last bite for you. I think I'm done. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is for you. So good. Last few bits, just to mop them up. This is not a biryani that you should waste. And the good thing out here is that they serve you the biryani in different portions. So beginning with a 250 gram to a half kilo, one kilo, and a one kilo with the box. So you can actually begin your biryani experience for as less as rupees 60. And I'm told that is Mr. Mohammad Tofi, who is the proprietor of this store. Soft piece. Soft piece. Chote. Chote piece. Soft. Ye piece khao tum, ye piece khake batana mujhe. Okay. So chawal kya? So kya naam kya chawal? Galaxy. Galaxy. But sela hai ye. है ना सेला है ना बहुत बढ़िया सेला ये कितने साल से है तोफिक बिरयानी चौबीस साल से उन्नीस सौ अठानवे में शुरू हुआ आपका वेरी नाइस दिस इज पिकल विच दे पुट वाइल द बिरयानी इज कुकिंग ओके चिली पिकल ओके टेक इट आउट And okay. If somebody wants it a little spicy, they give uh. you one side. So hence it's got rice and pickle and chilies. Oh, so this goes into the biryani. So okay. that was a chicken biryani, and this is a buff biryani. जब आप chicken biryani खाते हो, usually for a biryani lover, chicken biryani is ठीक है, you know, a consolation prize. Absolutely. But आपने पहला निवाला डाला मुंह में. You were transported to a different world yeah. altogether. Absolutely. So imagine if the chicken biryani does that for you. What can a meat biryani do? Therefore, I am tingling with excitement to see what this biryani has to speak to my palate. Try करिए पहले आप पहला निवाला आपका ज़रूर मैं ना नहीं बोलूँगा इसके लिए. I love the moistness of the rice. Every grain is separate quality. बहुत खिला खिला है हाँ. How's it? In this, I am tasting a little bit of the fat. The fat that comes from the meat. From the meat. Very mm. nice. Absolutely. And there's also a little smokiness to it. Smokiness to it. Huh? Slow braised. Slow braised. And you, this, you have to try to eat it. Hmm. Look at this. How warm it is. The meat is soft. It just falls off. In this, I can also taste a bit of the spiciness, though. Mm. Huh? A little bit of the green chilli heat. In the chicken, I couldn't taste it as much. This is more. 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 Mm. 
I think it's a little bit of pickle as well. A little bit of the spiciness, mm. the green chilli spiciness. In this meat piece, you're also tasting the savouriness. It just comes out. Ooh. It's so beautiful. This is the kareli, no? Yeah. Oh, that meat is juicy. The sort that falls off the bone and also quite gelatinous. Huh? Try. Mm. <laughs> I just placed it in my mouth. <laughs> it dissolves. <laughs> it just goes. It has disappeared. Beautiful. Delicious. Delicious. Body nazakat se bani hui Her flavor, texture, everything is very balanced. That's what Ooh. I like about this. Not too dry. You can just eat rice on its own. Meat on its own. You don't need any raita. You don't need anything with this. Chutney, kuch nahi chahiye. In fact, I'm saying this biryani is made so well that you may not even need too much of the meat. Meat. Absolutely. Maybe just a piece of the meat, and that's very good rising. Rising out here for 60 rupees, you get a plate of this. This is a quarter plate. You get two pieces of meat. You got enough rice. You got a little bit of the chutney on the side in case you want a bit of the spicy kick. And that's actually quite enough to give you a good taste of what a biryani should be all about and after all when you come here you're actually on a bit of a food trail so you're tasting from one famous stall to the other so it's a nice way to That's round things off most of the shops oh. they give small portions as well so it's good for people who are tasting for everybody mm, so good there's also a certain saltiness in that meat, no? Nobody has. This uh, is the character is, of the meat. The, the cooking of this meat is so good. It's like there. It's right there. Certified by the chef. <laughs> Let's taste a bit of the chutney now. Let's see. This is a achar. It's 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 a I like it without it because this it takes it in a completely different direction. I don't want to eat achar, it's already in the biryani while it was being cooked. Just eat that biryani rice by itself with or without the meat. I'm so glad you liked it. This is my last evening here in Old Delhi on this trip and I'm so happy that we came here and we tasted this biryani and that piece of meat is moist, is juicy uh, it's a sort that breaks away easily with the gentlest of bites look at this that's the gelatin yeah, in the meat that's rendered into that biryani Wow. Yeah, well, that is it. You sure you don't want the bun? I go. Okay, I'm going to eat it. He asked me a question saying, Kripal, are you sure you don't want the last piece of meat? I was holding the camera. <laughs> Before I could place it down to say, Ha, Amit, if you insist, I will try it. Halia. <laughs> that, that is the appeal of this biryani. Fantastic. <laughs> you know what I'm also tasting in this biryani is a little bit of the chili heat. They cook rice separate. Ah. So, it's separate. Ah, so whether it's a chicken biryani or the mutton the biryani? It's braised separate. The mutton is braised separate. And then they would lay the rice on top. So, the rice so, has that achari masala. Beautiful. But it's a little bit of a So, you need that thika pan to cut through the fat. Yes. Mm. So good. Mala aya. बनाने वाले की कलाकारी है <laughs> ये बिरयानी बनाने वाले की हाथ को चूमना पड़ेगा उतनी अच्छी बिरयानी बनी है ये when you come here on your food trail of Jama Masjid make it a point to come here to Mohammed Tafiq दिल पसंद बिरयानी point it's a bit of a walk from the gate number one Jama Masjid but certainly the sort that's worth that effort absolutely absolutely Apart from the food that you're eating, you're also coming across some very interesting gems. So, for example, we saw this store there called 
Nuri masala, which seems to have a masala mix, a spice mix for every preparation possible, for every Mughlai preparation possible. I think that's the other thing about a food tour here. There's so much that you can discover. There's so much that you can unearth. This is the oldest shop. 1980. There was a cool point here. The famous is our Shahi Tukla. We've seen quite a few cool points. We don't know which one, but I'm told this is the one that goes way back. Shahi Tukla. Vidrabadi. This is our Shahi Tukla. This is our most famous item. मुगलाई आइटम है ये मुगलाई डिश। आपका नाम क्या है? एतिशाम नाम है सर मेरा। एतिशाम। एतिशाम। जी सर। 1950 से उस शॉप है हमारी। पूरी मार्केट में सबसे पुरानी शॉप हमारी है। ये रबड़ी होती है सर हमारी। बदाम वाली। बदाम वाली और आपका फलूदा। फलूदा होता है। खीर होती है हमारे पास। फिर नहीं? फिर नहीं। हाँ। और हमारा मैंगो आइसक्रीम, मैंने आइसक्रीम होती है भाई होममेड आइसक्रीम होती है ये मलाई होती है सर इसकी हाँ हाँ बहुत खोए से बनती है मलाई है और ये डबल रोटी है ना नीचे हाँ ये ब्रेड होती है इंडिया में इट्स द फ्लेवर ऑफ़ द तोपा हाँ द घी घी सी व्हेन यू लुक एट दिस डिशेस राइट ऑन द आउटसाइड दे लुक वेरी गैरिश वेरी कलरफुल and you're actually sometimes wondering whether it's going to be too sweet, too rich. But the one thing that I take away from most of the things that we've tasted here, not too sweet. It's good balance. I think they know how to cook the foods well. You know, everybody says they've been around for a while. These guys say they've been around for the since 1935. I really don't know because there are many eateries here which have the same name. They're very similar facades. And if you're somebody who's new, you really don't know. So I think we were a little confused and we've entered one shop which said that they were the oldest. Ribal, I'll say it would have been a family business. The front is one and the shop is split into two. So, so that so could have happened. Maybe generations just, have... Just two generations. One started early, one generation kept it. The original one and the Saath Wala, the, they make the same thing. Mm. Now they're in competition with each other. But the product looks very similar. The product looks very similar, very similar. and it tastes rather nice. Absolutely. Huh? It is good. It's good. And थोड़ा सा मुंह मीठा करके हमने शुरुआत जलेबी से की थी हाँ और यू नो लेट्स राइट सो वी हैड बिगन अ ओल्ड दिल्ली फूड टूर विद दी ओल्ड एंड फेमस जलेबी एट चांदनी चौक चांदनी चौक जलेबी वाला जलेबी वाला एंड इट इस फिटिंग दैट वी आल्सो क्लोजिंग आर ओल्ड दिल्ली फूड वॉक फूड टूर विद समथिंग स्व Fantastic. So thank you very much, Amit. <laughs> it's been a pleasure. Refresh my memories also of good food in Walled City. As much as we enjoyed eating, I also enjoyed, you know, seeing you do it. <laughs> Fantastic. I've enjoyed thoroughly, Amit, my time with you. Pleasure. And thank you for uh, showing us Old Delhi through your eyes. And when you're walking with a chef, it's not just about the dishes, but it's also about understanding the nuances that make those dishes special. And I think I've learned so much. Thanks in the for giving of... me this opportunity. I hope you've enjoyed this series too. If you did, give this video and all the videos in this series a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, do consider subscribing. We'll see you on the next one. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Fantastic. If you'd like to support the work that we do at Food Lovers TV, do consider joining our membership community on YouTube by hitting the join button below or on the home page. You could pledge a nominal sum and receive special privileges like behind the scenes footage, shoot updates, access to live Q&As and a lot more. You could support us on our Patreon page as well. For more info, check out the links in the description below. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, share and leave a comment below. Happy eating!